might think that after driving a Dodge Challenger Hellcat during the week of the Woodward Dream Cruise, seven days with a diesel-powered Volkswagen Golf Sport wagon would be a letdown. You know, like following a shot of Jack Daniels with a sippy cup of Metamucil, Metamucil. Before continue, please subscribe, share and comment. Thank you. But it ended up being perfect timing. Right at the end of my Challenger loan, I signed my name what felt like 1,241 times, handed over a very, very large check, and officially bought my first home. The sport wagon arrived on moving day, and I set about putting the long roof's hauling ability to the ultimate test, slapping everything I owned to my very first house. Sport wagons, like Metamucil, can often be very good for you, good for you. The wagon's cargo area isn't dramatically bigger than the standard Golf, 30.4 cubic feet versus 22.8, unless you fold the second row down. With the seats flat, the Golf Sport wagon's advantage nearly doubles, to 66.5 cubic feet. But it's not just the extra space that makes moving things a lot easier. The rear hatch is more defined and sits atop a lower bumper. The load height is just 24.8 inches, while the tailgate opens to an aperture of 40.6 inches. It also opens high enough that your 6-foot, 1-inch author can stand tall below it, below it.